Turns out the only way I could think of getting this to work was to um, grab this tool here and sort of bend it a little bit more before trying to get to go in. But still, it's um, it's really not working that well. Because now it kind of fits there, but I'm still not getting this whole lot of love. Trying to get that part in. Maybe we need to do it the opposite way, like push it in this way, like that. And then use this to bend it a little bit more. And then push it back in. I mean, this is ridiculous. This, this part of the process is definitely its downfall for me. As I'm testing this machine, I'm like, really? This is, this is what they had planned? Um, so, yeah. Looks like it kind of went in. But is this really a good way? This could just still fly out. I don't think so. I am really not liking this part of the process. But again, I know why they gave you two of these because this part of the process is so hard and there's a good chance that while you're trying to do this, you either break the little screen here or this thing keeps flying out and you cut your finger or I don't know. This probably isn't hard for a machine, but for a human to do. So maybe they should just have a machine do this. All right, anyway, it did finally go in. I hope that's good enough. I've been able not to damage this too much, so hopefully it'll still work. But all you gotta do next is, of course, screw it in here, and you're done with this part of the process. How much you need to screw this in, I'm not sure. I'll have to look at the instructions, but that's where we're at so far. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.